Good morning, everyone. I'm here in the Creation Guild with one of my new paintings from the summer called Untethered Freedom. And I just wanted to take a minute to talk to you about Untethered Freedom and kind of what it means to me and hopefully it can connect to you too. I remember a time many, many years ago, I was driving home from work and at that time I worked in an office which was a very negative, oppressive office environment and it had been a really hard day. And I was driving through the country road and alongside the road there were horses in a field. And as my car drove past them, they started to run along with my car. And I've never had that happen since then. It was one of those wonderful, beautiful moments. Uh, the horses were running playfully, kicking up their heels, swinging their necks. And I remember it just brought me back to the moment. And I just felt such a huge release and weight lifted off my shoulders. It was one of those moments of like, ah, oh, yes. <laughs> and I loved it and I, I it stayed with me that was oh probably 25 years ago and I still remember that feeling uh, that 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 those horses brought to me and so in Alberta here many of us are lacking that feeling of freedom right now it's been tough lately it's been really hard uh, it's been very dry here and in many ways many different ways we've pulled from the earth the, our oil field people are feeling it and the earth is feeling it. The weather has been dry, so farmers are feeling it. And also, you know, school year starting up again. Families are starting to feel those pressures of buying more school supplies, getting the kids ready for school, buying their shoes, that sort of thing. So uh, as these pressures build up in our life, we can feel very negative. Uh, without us even realizing, negativity kind of creeps in and all of a sudden we stop and go, wait a minute, I've been really negative about my whole life lately. And making those car payments or mortgage payments can be, uh, you know, really make you put you in a bad mood, make you feel very negative, and it weighs down on us, right? So those monthly payments can be hard. Um, we're feeling quite the opposite of freedom. When really we need to remember that those things that we're making our monthly payments for are the gifts in our life. And we've brought them into our life. We manifested that lifestyle. And it's easy to lighten the load, you know, get rid of stuff you don't need bring ease into your life. This is the time to do it. Don't get rid of your children though. Those are our blessings. So, but you, you can also um, just make choices, right? And it only takes a shift in your perspective um, to begin to um, bring in that light again and make yourself feel light and free again. Even if things aren't shifting on the outside, we can make the changes on the inside. We have choices, we always have choices. When we bring back that feeling of uh, gratitude and lightness in our heart, that's, that's when life gets filled with joy again. And slowly you'll start to see the outside, things on the outside start to shift and change for you. Um, freedom feels like lightweight, easy, uh, flowing, expansion, um, adventures, that feeling of being able to go out on adventures and, and just kick up your heels and, and have some fun, right? That's, that's the feeling of freedom. So we need to capture that feeling. We need to bring it into our lives. We need to make the change and the shift and bring those feelings in because that's when we start to make changes or see changes on the outside. So here in this beautiful country of Alberta, we've got horses all around us, reminding us of the beauty and freedom uh, that, uh, that our lives of free will bring us. And if we take a drive through the back country, we still have wild horses. And I mean, that's, that's something not everyone can say. So go back through the back country, watch the horses, bring in that feeling, connect to that feeling of freedom. And in Alberta, we love our horses. We love our land. We love our big skies. Um, we love our freedom. Okay. This time is temporary. The dryness will uh, ease 
and abundance will flow again for everyone, but you need to bring that feeling into you. So I hope you enjoy Untethered Freedom, and I hope that it brings those feelings of freedom to you. All right, hang in there, friends. Things will get better.